Pantheon's pretty fucking good right now. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another pathetic excuse for a rank video. <laughs> we're, we're a 20, 23 year old guy who has played League of Legends for almost, if not more than seven years, <laughs> struggles to <laughs> struggles to get out of Cold 5. <laughs> Today, we're gonna teach you. I say teach you. I'm gonna try and abuse the fact that I feel like Pantheon's a fucking broken champion right now, and uh, he's in a really good place. I say that. Watch me fucking feed. Nevertheless, we're against Teemo top lane. The reason for this being, I actually saw a post on Reddit not that long ago that was talking about the fact that Pantheon actually has like an over 50% uh, win rate. It, and it can it ranges from over 50 to over 60%, depending on the sample size. Um, he has a, a massive like 54% win rate if, uh, before the, uh, the 35 minute mark as well. On top of that, of course, his early game is absolutely ridiculous. And, uh, yeah, he's just a pretty, he's a bully champion, man. He makes people, he makes champions his bitch. That is his purpose in life. And the fact is, as well as that, he's he's very similar to Twisted Fate, who you've probably heard me rant and rave about for the last, oh, fucking knows how long, to be honest. I've been ranting and raving about, uh, about Twisted Fate for a, a fairly long period of time. Um, just about how he can, like, zip and zap into lanes and smack people with cards. Uh, shit like that. Same thing with Pantheon. He can just fucking man drop into any lane that he wants uh, and basically just make them his bitch. So, yeah, we're just gonna kill this guy right here. So he's gonna die. We didn't get first blood because Zillion died bot lane, so that kind of sucks. But nevertheless, what we're gonna basically try and do uh, uh, is we're gonna try and snowball. And that's basically it. We're gonna try and snowball as hard as possible in the early game and try and carry that through to other uh, to other lanes as well. With the, uh, the, man the Mantheon man drop ability. Uh, we can help other lanes, and that's, that's, I mean, I hate other people. If this was, if it was possible, I would play this game on my own. I, th I feel like I'd have a better chance. 1v5. Uh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, I would try, yeah. I mean, I, 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 I can help other lanes. I can help mid lane. Although, Corky isn't the best gank in the world, if I'm being perfectly honest with you. Bot lane, though. Uh, Caitlyn and Sona. She's 2-0. They're fucking terrible, but, you know, the, the potential is still there. That's, is that, that's all that really matters in the end. The potential. I can drop on their faces, and I can just basically 100 o them, if I'm lucky. That's probably not going to happen, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try and make it happen. The Teemo is, like, harassing me ever so slightly here. But he's, uh, he's playing with fire. This, this, oh, shit. Hey, I should have fucking known that that was going to be a thing that happened. That's just my fucking fault right there. Uh, but let's see. Let's grab... Uh, let's grab uh, Control Ward. Make sure that, that doesn't fucking happen again. Um, with uh, with Evelyn. Who got the kill? I hope it was Evelyn. She did get the kill. I say I hope it was Evelyn. She's clearly just going to start stomping other lanes with that one kill. She is a, a, a dick stompy kind of ca character. But yeah, I, uh, I'm playing Pantheon. Played him in a, a video recently as well. Uh, I don't know if there's something up with the sub boxes or nothing. If you guys are watching this, you're my subscribers. Let me know, because uh, it, it got like a very... The, the, the last videos in the last, you know, two or day or so uh, surrounding that got uh, a very small amount of views compared to usual. I'm, I'm very surprised. There were videos that I, I, I thought would do pretty well. And they did. They still got lots of likes and stuff. stuff. They still did fine. You guys still enjoyed them. The ones who saw it still enjoyed it. But uh, I, I don't think a lot of people got to really uh, <coughs> see it. And, um, you know, uh, career on YouTube. Kind of need those views. You know what I'm saying? Um, gotta, 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 gotta get those views. I feel like Timo's just sitting fucking invisible somewhere. Waiting for me to, like, appear. Waiting for each other. No, actually, he's just right there. Never mind. <laughs> I'm talking so much garbage. Uh, okay, let's get that. I really want to get out of goal five. Like, it is my fucking birth... I feel like it's my birthright. To be fair, though, I started in goal five this season. So, uh, I have no real reason to complain, I guess. Like, I didn't do well in my promos. Like, I didn't start my provisionals well. They started pretty horribly, if I'm honest. Uh, so I really shouldn't have uh, gotten the ability to actually begin in, in, in the elo where I like, you know, you get you get that uh, victorious skin. Because that's pretty much, that's what we all play League of Legends for, right? That's what that's what we all do it for. 
that's what we all uh, play ranked for. Am I right? Like the victorious skin. That's that's literally it. That's the only reason. I feel like I'm not doing any damage with these uh with this shit right now. If Evelyn comes though, I'm I'm definitely screwed. But uh, yeah, nonetheless, we we'll hope that that doesn't become an issue. He's definitely trying to bait me under tower with the uh, try to bait me under tower with the the mushroom as well. If there's a mushroom under that tower. I know for a fact that there is. Uh, he's gonna try and bait me under and then blind me and hope to Christ that I, I that a combination of my ignite and the various a, a variety of other things don't get don't kill him. I uh, I feel like I'm like lagging ever so slightly. I've got 30 ping, but I'm like walking under towers and I'm like I feel like I'm clicking. Maybe I'm just rusty. I don't know. Thankfully though, I do have my Aegis, which is like the best, the most <laughs> annoying spell in the game. Like, if you've ever played Attack Speed Pantheon, or played against Attack Speed Pantheon, you could probably attest how annoying this is, right? That'll pop, there we go. Kaboom. Am I not gonna kill her? I didn't ignite her! I didn't ignite her, dude! Oh no! Oh no! I have ignite up still. That is. Oh, I was actually so fucking confident about that as well, dude. I was. I And you know what? I should have been, because it was an easy fucking kill that I just barked like a, an actual fucking imbecile. Um. Yeah, what are you doing, Ross? Are you fucking bronze? Let's get a fucking hex drinker. Let's get boots. Let's get back to lane. If we can man drop on something or someone, preferably someone, I'm going to do so. I see a fucking Timo. I see a fucking Timo. I don't know if he has fucking flash. I think he might. Nevertheless, he's gonna definitely back off the second he gets this. He's gonna he's gonna back off. He ain't that stupid. He's not gonna stick around to get barked. Nevertheless, okay. We got dragon. So, whilst my stupid play that uh, could have very easily got me a kill if I wasn't so fucking stupid, uh, whilst that was a bad thing that happened, and I feel like my game is just like being a bit unresponsive, um, we got dragon out of it, mountain dragon, good dragon, and uh, yeah, we, we're, we're, we'll see what we can do now. We have got ourselves a, oh fuck, we have got ourselves a hex drinker as well, against Evelyn. In fact, pretty much against every single member of their team, I don't think, uh, I don't think Timo's gonna be building AP straight up, but, uh, it's definitely going to, uh, still be a good, still be useful considering all of his damage as AP. Let's see. On top of that, like, Corky does magic damage, like, a lot of magic damage. Um, Sona does magic damage, Evelyn does magic damage. There is really no end to the usefulness that we can have against this particular team, so. I like how, you know, I'm probably going to take this video, like, abusing this champion, and I am getting abused. But, uh, we're going to have more than one game, so it's, 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 it'll be fine. It will be fine. Uh, I, I'm not sure what to max second, right? So we got like this. I like the, uh, I like the extra cooldown on it, but that being said, I don't know if it's, like, actually high enough cooldown to warrant its uh, usefulness. Okay, so we lived, barely. <laughs> Thankfully, when minions figure out if this is bad stuff or not. I'm tanking so much tower here, dude. Oh, no. If I had tanked one fucking less tower hit, I'm fucking standing out here. Or if I, maybe if I'd done the man drop. Fuck, dude. If I'd done the man drop, there's a good chance I would have survived. If I'd stopped tanking fucking towers for days, maybe I would have survived. We can, we can, we can kill here. Like 100% we can kill. Woo! One of my uh, spicy items on Pantheon. After that, I really, really like Edge of Night on Pantheon. Okay, see the having the ability to uh, 
having the ability to have damage as well as a Banshee's Veil without really comp like having to compensate, it's really nice. All you gotta do, drop the Edge Knight, then ex then drop the fucking uh, the ulti down. You have yourself a spicy, spicy combination. I'm 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 on my way. Here we go. Oh my god, dude, I did so much damage. Okay. Ah, there we go. That was not a necessary man drop to make. I gotta say that. <laughs> There was no universe in which I needed to manage. I could have just walked around and got her. <laughs> it would have been faster to walk around and hit her. But I, I chose not to do that. Why exactly? I, I don't really know. Okay, I died. Get something out of this though, boys. There we go. We got we got four no, we got five kills. I killed Sona. I killed Sona, I killed Corky. I killed uh Caitlyn. Did I kill Evelyn? Did I get four kills? I'm not really sure. I definitely did a shitload of damage in that fight. I definitely fucking commanded that fight. Like, you know, there's no denying that one. There's no denying that one. As bad as I am, um, yeah, as much terror damage as I'm sure I took. 600 damage from terrors. Ugh. Uh, despite all that, yeah, that was still a good result, I'd wager. All right, we. Hmm. They're getting co Oh, I just made the fuck out all y'all. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Let's drop this. Hey, boys. How's it fucking going? It's PewDiePie here. Oh, you lucky son of a bitch. He's still dead though. That exhaust. That fucking exhaust though. I'll take it. I'll take it. We can get Baron off of that. I just fucking single handedly like wrecked the shit out of like three members of the team. Yeah. I'll surely take that. What the fuck are we doing here? What, what are you guys doing? What? What? As. Bye. Uh, okay, we actually are going for it. Okay. Okay. Well, they're all bought. Okay. They have actually gone a full team bot lane. Alright, I guess I'm coming in on this one then. Okay. The blunt was even there. <laughs> we lost our AD carry very early on. Don't really know what happened, but we, we won the game. Wow. GG. Good game. Let's go for another. <clears throat> Alright, I'm back on Pantheon. Pantheon, the champion is abusing Soul Q. That's just how it's going. That's how it is. Nevertheless, we're gonna be we're doing jungle this time. I'm basically just queuing for top and jungle, that's pretty much all I'm going for. Uh, cause he just feels, he feels good in those two roles. I'm against Vi. I can really, I could make use, I could really, I could really fuck her up if I'm honest. If I'm, if I'm careful and concise. Uh, we have like all the boys coming through right now. Like this is perfect. We can go in again. We can go in again on this, uh, this Yasuo. Let's -a go. Oh, beast mode. Oh, crap. I mean, 
Uh, I'm not fast enough. There we go. There we go. That's what we're talking about. That's what we want. I'm coming through. Daddy's coming. You know? I don't have man drop. I don't know if I can get there in time. Good to try though. But they are. They are on dragon. Okay. 600 health. I got it. I got it. She got a fuck with a health from so uh, Soraka. I got it though. How is this Vi 7 and 5? That's like. She's got fucking Poacher's Dirk. Is she really? She's not counter jungle with a single thing this whole game from me. But she's like, no, I'm gonna get that. It's a good idea. Good idea, good aiming. Oh, there we go. Shen down. Fucking raid boss has been destroyed. Here we go. Another kill for me. We're working this out. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, you silly, silly girl. Okay, that's pretty much... That's pretty much the throw we've been waiting for, I guess. Do we want to do this? We killed four of them. I'm really not all that strong, but okay. Okay, Guardian Angel has been purchased. Yep. Oh, that strike is so loaded. Woo! Hey, my GA ain't up for now, like two minutes, or some shit. This kind of that's kind of feels bad. Should be able to, there we go. He still died to the Caitlyn. They are uh, their their base is taking a pounding though. Like that's kind of one of those things where uh, we can kind of somewhat afford that just because we're doing really really well and it kind of it resulted in a Nexus Tower release. So yeah. Oh. Destroyed. We just like, yeah, that's <laughs> that's a fucking game over. That's the game over. That's the surrender. Good stuff. Well, Pantheon is strong. I like Pantheon. I would recommend. I, no, actually, never mind. Don't play him. He's got a three percent pick rate, but like over fifty percent win rate. So just don't pick him. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for watching me get tilted, and I actually did fairly okay for two games. Two or three games, we did okay. Nevertheless, once again, thank you so much for watching. Uh, Gabby down below, all that jazz. Take it easy, see you tomorrow.